With school beginning, one of the things I always think about is destination graduation. I don't know if you've ever been to one of these events, but it is fascinating. This year it's going to be a little bit different. I think they've got some great ideas and Dr. Tom Duncan is here to tell us a little bit about when graduation, destination graduation will be and what all you'll get to see. And I brought with me today McGee High's new principal, Deborah Ware, because this right. is her first indoctrination into our little event. So she's um, going to be destinated for her first time here, here at McGee. Um, we are going to host destination graduation as an entire district this year. You know, usually we had something at Tiger Field and something at Trojan Field, but this year we're going to do it all together. And for this time, we're going to start in Mendenhall. Next year, we'll go to McGee, and we're going to you have promise. Prom night. <laughs> you promise. Know. Prom you know, you know, you know how that is. <laughs> yeah. But um, obviously, you've seen some of these posters in the school. Uh, we have them bigger in the school, but. This tells the child what grade they're in and what year they're going to graduate. And that's what the whole intent is, is to get them indoctrinated that our kindergarten kids know they're the class of 2027. Okay, hold it up. Isn't that weird? And, um, 2027. And actually, when we had our SACS accreditation review, some of our elementary kids that knew when they graduated, that made an impression on those folks because that's what it's all about, is staying with that peer group all along and graduate. Now, this year... August 21st from 6 to 8 p.m. We'll do the parade lineup. We've got some church bands that are going to come and play on stage. We've got Minnie Holloway who's going to sing a oh, I love it. She's fabulous. Rendition. She's fabulous. She, oh um, my gosh, yes. And then about every 20 minutes, we're going to stop everything and do a street dance that'll be like a move to learn activity because, you know, our healthy initiative, mm -hmm. our nutrition initiatives, uh, all the things that we're trying to do this year with our physical education grant called Simpson Steps. We want to get, get people moving. And so Coach Nowell, Coach Anderson, are they're both going to be there with some Tigers and Trojans, and they're going to show the kids how to do workouts, how to do skills, sports skills. We've got the dentist. We've been able to get a grant for like $1,000. and We're going to give everybody a toothbrush and a toothpaste and you know, all kinds of stuff. Uh, the hospitals are going to come, and they're going to do blood pressure checks and all kinds of things. So it's really going to be a community-wide event, but focused on uh, getting kids knowing when they're going to graduate, staying healthy, and being a part of what needs to happen to achieve destination graduation. Sounds August 21st, Main Street, Mennonite. All right, sounds like a festival to me. Mm -hmm. I hope it's something that you'll attend and make sure that your child is there. We'll have additional information concerning the event on mcgeenews.com. And again, if you ever have questions concerning this or any other thing, contact me at sue at and we'll find out the answer for you.